we can't even talk about Crystal Hap. Let me go ahead and because this right here is Emmy Moore, probably that crazy teacher. Um, let's get back to this. So I'm bullying a teacher. That's what you think, that I'm bullying a teacher, a teacher that has attacked me, right? That is obsessed with me, that won't leave me alone, that won't leave me out of her mouth. I don't say shit about anybody. What do you mean me bullying her? It's if you go to her channel, let's correct these, this misinformation on my channel. I guarantee you go to any channel I have. You do not have me, uh, any, any, uh, content creators on my thumbnail. Definitely not to speaking out of them to them in disparaging remarks whatsoever. I don't even allow my audience to speak about other creators and disparaging remarks, but you're saying I'm bullying a teacher that won't leave me alone. I'm not the one going after her. You understand that, right? She's coming after me publicly. And you are trying to say that I have no right to defend myself or to take corrective action. I think you're absolutely wrong. I think you're on the wrong side of this. And I don't know what people are putting in your head that makes you think that somebody can attack me nonstop for months and not have any repercussions from that. What idiot do you think I am? And what idiot are these people? They're playing some real sick game with you guys as emotions, trying to play victim. How are they the victim? I'm not attacking them, dumb dumb. Have you not realized that I'm not the one creating this? Have you not? Can you take off your, your blinders here and see? I'm not doing this to these people. The proof is in the fucking pudding. Go to all my channels. Mark, Emmy, who am I attacking? Who am I bullying? I'd like you to provide me receipts, please. Because a lot of people call me the, a bully on here when I don't bully a damn person, don't even talk to them, and try to stick to these cases, which I can't because I got idiots like you coming into my chat. So please tell me how I have bullied this idiotic, obsessive teacher that won't leave me alone that clearly has mental problems. And how can I say that? Because she really will not leave me alone. She is so obsessed that she keeps coming in here even after I have asked her multiple times to leave me alone. What would you like me to do, Mark Hall? What would you like me to do? I would like, I would like an answer. Because I'm doing everything I can to protect myself from these animals. And if you don't like it, maybe you need to be over on their channels telling them to stop it. Because I'm getting sick and tired of you coming here saying I'm the bully when I'm covering true crime cases and staying out of the fucking drama. I will absolutely go to her school if she doesn't leave me alone. She is harassing me. Or do you forget that? Are you saying that you don't think I have a right to exercise every lawful um, tool at my disposal when I'm being bullied online? Do you honestly think I do not have a right to put an end to this going on in my life? I will use any and all means necessary to get this shit to stop. If you do not like it, stay out of me. Stay away from me. Stay out of my business. And move on with your fucking lives. Like it's it's 15 days to Christmas. And today's a church day. And you've got me saying cuss words on a Sunday because you're too much of an idiot to realize there wouldn't be no problem if you guys didn't start no problems. But if you think I'm going to be that kind of woman that's just going to keep sitting here and taking this day after day, you've got it wrong. I will make sure every single person is fired from their job. I will expose every person on here. And I will make sure that every boss knows the kind of shenanigans that their employees are doing behind the scenes. So if you don't want that attention for yourself, my suggestion would be to leave me alone. You know I will do it. You know I have threatened it. You know I will have no problem exercising it. You know I do not have a problem getting in a, in a car and going to a location and being on public property with a bullhorn. You know I will do that. So why do you keep stepping in the shit and then acting like you're a victim when I finally exercise those rights after you know what the result would be? 
So if you know the result will be me calling your work or me exposing your name or me showing up with a bullhorn, why would you put me to that point where I have to exercise those? But don't think they are the victim. Because if you go to any one of these channels, they are filled, littered with awful things about me that are completely, absolutely untrue. And then you come over here and you see real content about these cases. And then you go over there and all they do is bully, 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 bully. And good God, let me say one thing about me being bully. And they're the victim. Cut it out. That is some delusional, messed up brain problem shit if I've ever heard it. Pull your head out of your ass. Now that I'm done correcting that, because like I said, I'm done keeping silent. You guys are fucking idiots if you believe that I'm the problem at this point. You are deluded. They tried to have me hurt myself or do something outlandish for a click and a view for their content. That to me is sick. And anybody that supports any type of channel that does that to another human being, you are twisted and demented. And I will expose that. Bet your ass on that. Cry me a river. Build me a bridge. If you don't want me in your shit, stay out of mine. That's the answer. Now, we're going to get back to the case that actually deserves some attention. I know you drama queens out there love drama. You don't give a shit about nobody else. All you care about is your pocketbook, your clicks, your views. We actually care about these families. So if you're not here to advocate for a family, we don't want you here. I shouldn't have to block you. Just leave. Just leave. Okay? People are laughing. We got 51 people in our chat when we've had a couple hundred, right? It's no big deal because we're still meeting the same fucking numbers, right? But they don't want to tell you that. They want to twist you around and make you think, oh, my God, I'm on a new platform and we got 51 people. Like, people have been here on here for freaking five years that can't even get 51 people in their chat after five years. And here we are one week on this channel and we've got hundreds and thousands of views. We've already had over 10,000 views this week alone. Cut it out. The delusion that nobody likes me is over. It's over. You know why? Because this is what you guys are going to have to just deal with, and maybe you don't like it. But I'm Bullhorn Betty. And you'll never beat me. So suck it up. Suck it up. Now we're going to get back to our cases. We're done.